Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, family. Welcome, welcome to this mental house with walls. With me, your host, Khadija. You know what? When you don't have integrity, When you don't have integrity, there's no telling how far you can slink, sink down. Because today I heard one of the worst stories about uh, the authorities that uh, arrested 25 people and accused of them of operating a multi-million dollar scheme in South Florida that helped thousands of people take shortcuts to become nurses okay in operation nightingale the defendants are accused of operating and recruiting for three nursing schools the sacred heart institute of uh south of in fort lauderdale seeing college of health in lawton hill and palm beach school of nursing in West Palm Beach, all of which are now shut down. The deeply concerned allegations at the center of the investigation goes against the very tenets of the nursing profession. Wow. Prosecutors allege that the school prepared and sold fake transcripts to nursing candidates, knowing that the candidates would use the documents to sit for exams, secure licenses, and obtain nursing jobs. The authority said the school sold 7,600, that's 7,600 fake nursing diplomas since 2016 at $15,000 a pop, netting them more than $114 million. This is capitalism gone mad. Do you understand what happens when you don't have integrity and you allow to come to a system like America? Or you live in a system of America and you don't have any, any integrity because, again, what kind of seeds do you expect to grow out of a country that was founded on bloodshed, murder, thievery? All those things and narcissistically pretending that they never happened. That's why I said America is the home of narcissism. It breeds narcissists. So if you're not a uh, severe narcissist and you live in America, that's, 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 that, it's amazing. If you, even ha- if you even care. But if you can't see it, On a larger scale, if you can only see it because your father or your mother was a narcissist, but you don't see that they they're just the seeds that grew out of this country. Of narcissism and all the institutions are there flying monkeys. So now we got people who knew. That they were corrupt. And allowed them. To sell these fake nursing diplomas for fifteen thousand dollars each, and it netted them more than a hundred and fourteen million. Look at this, people. Look at this. These things go beyond black and white. Investigators said that the thousands of diplomas sold, about a third, are actually practicing medicine. Mm. Mm. Okay. The most important thing for us was to make sure to the extent we're talking about health care is that we stop the bleeding. What we what do we learn when somebody gets injured? Stop the bleeding. I don't listen, this is all funny talk. What has happened, these people now have probably got themselves in other since twenty sixteen. If they know somebody that will allow them to do this 
on this level, they know somebody on the next level that allow them to be administrators or nurse uh, a license I mean nurse a uh, practitioners that's this is devastating um, this this is devastating anyway LaPointe said again the most important thing for us is to make sure to the extent we're talking about health care is that we just stop the bleeding what do we learn when somebody gets injured? Stop the bleeding. The bleeding is here to stop those schools from being able to put more fraudulent diplomas out in the public sphere. Again, I don't believe it. What y'all think about this? Now you got to be wondering if you go to the doctor, if this person that is a nurse coming in, get, administering you medicine or doing things, are they real? Do they have the credentials? Or are they just somebody that had $15,000 and paid for these fake ass documents? <sighs> Incredible. All right. I want to know what y'all think about this. If you like what you hear, please like and subscribe and share the channel, people. I appreciate every each and every one of y'all who are out there. I want to say hello to each and every one, to the, all my new subscribers, all of my uh, older and uh, subscribers that have be, been there from day one. I appreciate y'all. I thank you for being out there. I uh, hope y'all will uh, actually... Begin to send me these narcissistic, insane stories. Because when you do, I just share them with the rest of the family. And y'all get to see, we get to look at and examine narcissism. Not just from our family perspective. It's all around us. It's everywhere. Then you want to say, oh, narcissism on the workplace, narcissism in my home, narcissism in my school building. Narciss That's because America breeds them. When do we want to deal with it? The police department is full of narcissists. They get to run around and arrest people for using drugs or breaking the laws or whatever. And usually they planting drugs in people's cars. Or stealing drugs, or going into people's homes and stealing all kind types of unethical. Uh, this is not a Christian nation. Y'all already know. Y'all know what come next. Since you want to brag about being a Christian nation, this is a den of thieves. I'll see y'all in the next video. Leave your comment below, too, though. Tell me what y'all think about this craziness. I might have got a hold to one of them nurses. Mm, mm, mm.